Shadow in the Cloud, starring Chloe Grace Moretz, is a fun... Oh, this is a movie review, by the way. It's a fun, silly, stupid movie that is a guilty pleasure. And if you want to detach yourself from reality and just have a fun time at the movies, Shadow in the Cloud is your go-to, I guess. It's, I think it's the guilty guilty pleasure movie of 2020 what i mean by that is just you just have fun just stupid just just suspend all reality just uh, have fun with it with its um principles of uh storytelling and whatsoever uh Chloe grace moritz uh she did a phenomenal job with this role and it's just i had fun with it just the reason why i had fun with it is because let me tell you the story. The Shadow in the Cloud is about Chloe Grace Moritz, who is assigned. It's World War Two, or one World War Two. She's assigned to this uh, war plane, and there's men's, and she's the only woman in the board. And there's she she is stuck in the underbelly turret, and she's freaking out, maybe losing her psyche. It's the same. There's gremlins on board, and it's destroying the ship. Well. This warplane with these people are fighting soldiers or other warplanes and going through this mission. And don't know who to believe, her or the men. And it's based it's based on the greatest Twilight episode where William Shatner was fighting the Gremlin on Twilight Zone. Which is called, the uh, episode is, I think it's called 20,000 uh, Feet Above Air or something, I forgot. But... It's one of the greatest episodes. Want to make sure you check out Twilight Zone. Uh, I forgot which episode that was, but it starred William Shatner and the Gremlin. It's one of the greatest TV horror episodes, and and it uh, they based it on that. So Shadow in the Cloud is basically that Twilight Zone episode, um, just stretched out to an hour and a half. So that was a fun episode with William Shatner, and this one. Chloe Grace Moritz does a fine, a fine job of taking over the role of William Shatner and just stretching it beyond. If you like what I said, make sure you check out this film. As for my star review, I give it two and a half out of four stars. As I said, if you don't take this film seriously, you, the more fun you'll have. But if you say, oh, that was a stupid part, I shut this off. That's not the type of film for you. It's a guilty pleasure. And if you just want to have fun and just be silly and stupid then this is your film this is my film review of a shadow in the cloud that's it that's all i got two and a half out of four stars which is a passable grade yo peace out